Saints, I want to encourage you with this video, be financially wise. I just recorded a short message in which I warned you for financial devourers. Please listen, that message is about 11, 12 minutes long. And just a quick update. I've generated a link for those who want to send donations to support this ministry. Uh, there is a Revolut link for just 20 euros for those who want to send a small amount. I get on my account directly. Then you have a business link that's through my own business. I get it in on my uh, business account. And every cycle, so I don't have that immediately. But then you can fill in the, the own amount that you want to send. And if you pray with a debit card or credit card, when you to click on the link, you type the amount and you select as payment method credit cards. Then fill in your credit or debit card uh, details and then it's paid. Sometimes uh, the system is crashing, so it keeps on lingering and nothing is payment doesn't go through. Well, well, it's human technology. It sometimes fails, but that's the service I align on right now. So you can do that. And of course, you can always use PayPal if you want, even though there are people who prefer not to use PayPal. I don't prefer to be, uh, depend on PayPal. PayPal is still a useful tool. That's why I use it. And there are those who want to send to Western Union. That's okay also. But apart from donation, all of that, I want you to also invest in yourself. Don't donate to Ari Dostet if you haven't invested in yourself first. When you receive blessing from Heavenly Father, you, you are fed and then you feed others. You don't receive and you feed others and you're starving. Okay? So I thank you all for those that donated and sponsored this ministry. It will be greatly rewarded by the Heavenly Father. And I'll use every dime you give me to sponsor the kingdom of heaven on the earth. You know that? Just don't forget about yourself. Don't forget about yourself, saints. Because the world doesn't think about you. The world wants you gone. Okay? Straight facts. The world either drains you to sabotage you or they want you gone completely. So the world's not going to think about you. So invest in yourself. Be financially wise. And that also means... Beware of the people who only appear when there's something to gain from you. Look, if people often think about you when they're in need, that shows that you're blessed. You don't have to be offended by that. Or when someone is actually in need and think about you, there's nothing wrong with that. But if, if there are people who over and over again only appear after you, have financial, you gain a financial advantage off, you got paid or whatever, watch out. Those people are used by the enemy to keep you down, to keep you in poverty, to keep you in slavery, to keep you in stress. Beware of those satanic doors. Close them. Lower contact and if necessary, stop all contact with those financial devourers. Please. And... See it this way, if someone is not even willing to insist on improvement for themselves, why do you think they're going to support you in improving you? They don't even care about their own improvement, nor their own long-term well-being. Why do you think they'll care about your long-term well-being? They won't. So, be financially wise, decree and declare, remain active. Donate to other believers who are actually doing the work. But before that, invest in yourself also. It's not only about money. Invest time in yourself. Gain some knowledge. If you don't have a lot of knowledge, look for knowledge. Maybe it's time for you to read, to not read, it's time for you to learn a second language. Because maybe if English is only language you speak, maybe it's time for you to speak Spanish also, if you live in the United States, because Spanish is quite relevant also. Or maybe uh, you are an ancient believer, and maybe it's better for you to learn Arab also. I don't know. You can learn a new language, you can develop a new skill, you can get another degree if you want, if you have the opportunity. Just invest in yourself also, saints. Please. This is not an excuse to be selfish and forget about other people. No, but you exist too. You exist too. You matter too. Invest in yourself, saints. Don't feel guilty about it. Don't be ashamed. It's natural. Be at peace.